Good morning guys, it is nearly 9.45 in the morning and do you ever find that you just procrastinate and procrastinate when you need to get something done? I've been up since about half six this morning. I'll get the glory, we'll win the fight. How good does Age of Ultron look? Cannot wait for that film to come out. That is going to be getting watched straight away. Question for you all. Who's your favourite Avengers character? Come on, be honest now. Got to be the Hulk, can it? Hulk smashes everything. Anyway, welcome to next episode, guys. Leave Mass. It is now quarter to ten in the morning. Tidying it up and rearranging it. Got some rice cakes over there. There's the video. So, decided to get something to eat now, guys, before I start editing the video. So, I got one square crumpet with one serving of reduced fat cheese on top. 30 grams of, 30 grams of chocolate mint whey protein. And I've got a coffee over there. So, I'm going to get that down me. It's probably about 300 calories in this. Um, probably about 30 grams of carbs, maybe 30 grams of protein altogether as well. Uh, low in fat, because the, the fat will come from mainly the cheese. So, I'm going to get that down me, guy. Watching a bit of this guy, it's Travis S. Watch him get his romantic side on, see what that's about. Uh, check his channel out if you haven't already, you probably have already because he's got a lot more followers and subscribers sorry, than me. On the notion of talk about subscriber guys, subscribers are slowly going up so I appreciate every single one of you for subscribing. Let's try and get me to 100 subscribers before Christmas guys. Appreciate all the support from everyone out there, all the channels. So I'm sure we can do it, I'm sure we can. Fingers crossed guys, 100 subscribers by Christmas. Mm. Nearly, nearly done editing this video guys. It's not taking as long, I've got a little bit of a voiceover to do on it and then a little bit of tweaks here and there just to check through it. It's a bit longer than usual, at the minute it's up to nearly 12 minutes so it's quite a long one. As you just saw, just having a quick break, gonna have one serving of this toffee popcorn because mm -hmm. message yep and I've one serving this toffee popcorn finish editing this and then probably take a nap because I've been up since stupid o'clock don't know if you can actually see me now guys because the sun is like blazing on my face but it is a little bit now later on I did not take a nap I decided to get the gym over with because I wanted to film for you guys and it might get busy a little bit later on. So that's where I'm going now, heading to the gym. It is a upper body workout. Uh, gonna be honest, I'm not really pumped for it, I think, because I've got up early, didn't get as much sleep. So at the moment, I am not pumped for this workout, but I do have pre workout with me and hopefully that'll kick in and we'll be able to get going. So, yeah, pre workout. So here we are guys in the gym, it is my bench footage for you guys from my full body upper, full upper body workout should I say. This is my final um, warm up set that you've seen here at 80kg and the plan for today was triples. I wanted to go for triples, hitting a new PR for triples. Uh, it's not heavy as some people on YouTube are going but as you know I'm working on my bench, it's one of my weak points. The plan was to work at 90kg for a triple which is about £200 and then increase by 5kg working my way up to 105 kg which is 230 pounds for triples that was the plan so at 90 kg was all right it's a bit of a struggle here you're seeing my 100 kg 220 pound 
attempt number one, which you'll see in a minute, didn't go to what go too well. I'm not sure, still not sure what exactly happened. It just didn't feel right. I was maybe I wasn't on the bench properly. I wasn't in the groove right. But as you can see here, leg slips out, and it just doesn't look good. What's <laughs> that's where accidents happens, guys. So I stopped, reset. I don't think my belt was in the right position, so I went back, reset, tried to get myself in the groove again and again it didn't feel right I managed to get a double as you'll see right now still a bit shaky on the bar and the final one's a bit of a grinder and I just I think my body seems to be rocking on the bench I don't seem to be comfortable maybe I'm just not in the position right so it didn't feel right I didn't want to push myself too f too much and injure myself maybe I could have pushed myself and done the workout how I planned but we'll never know, I didn't want to risk injury so I dropped the weight completely and moved on to pause wide grip press just really concentrating on that, pause for a second or two at the bottom on a wide grip and just try and improve that, something new that I'm incorporating just to see if it improves my bench you see some other YouTubers doing it at the minute so that's what I did guys uh, not too heavy, it didn't, the workout didn't go to plan but like I say I wasn't feeling the workout beforehand so I switched things up and didn't want to risk injury so that is going to be it for the workout footage guys, I finished off on doing a full body, full upper body workout which you have seen one of my previous workouts anyway so I don't need to go through everything. If you do like this video so far guys please remember to like, share and subscribe, I am slowly getting to that 100 subscribers so I appreciate everyone. Uh, I'll let the music play out on the footage now guys and I'll see you in the next clip, bye for now. Finishing editing up a video and doing some other work, uh, but luckily the mother's got me sorted on the post workout meal. Doing a Sunday roast right now that'll be ready in a couple of minutes. So I'm going to get that down me. I'll show you exactly what it looks like and what I'm having. So, this is what I'm going to have now. As you can see, it's one of them all cook boil in the bag type, well, microwave in the bag type thing. Six minutes in the microwave. So the ingredients, so it is just peri peri chicken and rice with some vegetables in there as you can probably see. Let's have a look. So it's got 55 grams of carbs, 3 grams of fat and 28.9 grams of protein. So I'm going to get this down me now, so basically just cut it off the Stick it in the microwave. You can't really be off making anything, so these are quite ideal. It's got quite a bit of salt in it, but I haven't had much salt. Well, I have actually today, that's a lie, because I had that roast dinner, that all I haven't had a lot of salt in it. But I'm not really too fussed, don't watch my salt at the minute. But yeah, I'm going to get this down, it probably leaves me with one more meal for today. We'll probably finish off my calories, I think. And I'll let you know what it is at the time, but I'm going to get that down me. Then I'm going to go out and walk the dog. Finish editing up some more videos and probably film another video tonight. So, just been asked about why I count my macros when I'm bulking. So I thought adds a little interesting topic to this episode. But why do I add? Why do I add? Why do I count macros while I'm bulking? Simple answer. I want to know how many grams of carbs. How many grams of fats, how many grams of protein, and how much grams of fibre I'm having on a daily basis. Now I'm not as strict as I would be if I was cutting, but I still like to know what what quantities of food I'm eating. So I don't count every last gram, but I have estimates of where I want to be. Estimates of where I want to be. And that's simple as it is. Um, I'm trying not to put on a lot of body fat during this bulk, whereas last year I got quite chubby. While bulking, so I'm doing a lean bulk this year, hence the title Lean Mass. And I think with. I think I, I personally think everyone should uh, track macros for a set amount of time just to get a ballpark figure of how much or how little they are eating in a day. It gives a good insight to how much food you are eating or how little you are eating if you do count your macros. Because some people don't visualise. I recently spoke to somebody 
who is trying to lose weight, not that they need to, and they thought they were just they thought they were eating too much, but they tracked the macros for a couple of days, and in one day this person was eating only about six seven hundred calories. Now even for dieting, that's not enough calories. This person was doing not so much a physical job, but a decent amount of exercise in a day, um, working out all the time, obviously. Sorry, I've just broke my chair. Yeah, that'll be my little rant over now with guys. Just thought I'd let you know why I went off on tangent then, didn't I? But why I count my calories when I'm bulking. Simple answer. Want to know how much food I'm eating? Do you ever just keep forgetting to do something and then find something out of the blue and then remember straight away where it's too late to go and sort it out now? Just for body power leaflets that I was supposed to go and give out today and I completely fucking forgot. I completely forgot. It slipped my mind so I'll have to do that now next week. Remember that is coming up soon guys. Getting closer and closer. Um, body power is in May. And if you want tickets, click the link below um, and check it out. So finished editing for the day, which is an awesome thing. So what I do now, guys, is I'm just going to chill out, finish off my macros with one of the meals that I actually... Two servings of toffee, nuts and more, peanut butter. Really good stuff. Quite expensive, though. I got it when it was on offer. Just a proper bro bodybuilding style meal, this plain rice cake. Finish for the day. So I'll finish for the day on 66 grams of fat, 402 grams of carbs, and 97, what, 197 grams of protein. Let's go to the diary. And here's all the food that I've had just to show that I have, oops, go back, just to show that I have had it. Why is it saying that? So 2,790 calories guys on my bulk. I'm gonna, I'm a little bit under on carbs. I wanted to go a little bit higher, so I might increase them as the weeks go on, but my training hasn't been as intense lately because of work, so I don't mind that. You only really want the extra carbs when I'm training heavy and hard, and this was, well it was, I suppose. I don't know, anyway. Hope you've enjoyed the video guys, that is it. I am out, I'm gonna watch some TV and just relax. It has been a day of filming and editing, eating, gym, filming, editing, eating, gym. So, time to just relax, chill out. Uh, again guys, appreciate all the support I've been getting. You guys are awesome. And if you haven't already, click subscribe, like the video, give it a thumbs up, appreciate that. And I will catch you in the next video, guys. See you on Thursday. I, I can see the pain it costs you. And I can see, girl, how it hurts you. But let me show you I can fix you.